All right, here, testing one, two, testing one, two. So, uh, happy weekend to all, happy Sunday to all. Hold on a second, I need to grab my, uh, I believe it's called Bavaria. It's a, it's a Costa Rican delight, so I'm uh, rifling, a, rifling a couple down here. <coughs> uh, <coughs> I'm severely Costa Rican at this point. You can see the, the kind of mountain-esque thing going on, uh, the, the rainbow disarray in the beer and the, uh, the, the demented beaver pelt going on in the, on the head here. But uh, it's been a great run. Uh, played tennis all six days since I've been here. I played four and a half hours today. A uh, little hurting, but at the same time, uh, I'm uh, still playing and I, uh, I, still, I still suck. So uh, tennis, I don't think it's ever going to come together. But uh, a couple days ago, we're hanging out, T-squared and I, and we're playing. And he, he's really good, so he's teaching me a lot. And there were these, uh, these four uh, Costa Rican kids hanging out. They were uh, totally tossed out of their mind, kicking back and just watching us. And I was going through uh, my whole, like, uh, Mac and Roll kind of spiel. And... Uh, uh, they were just laughing. They were just like laughing hysterically at me, calling me a crazy gringo. So I thought that was pretty funny uh, afterwards after I, I found out what they were laughing about. So uh, Tennis Club is very, very cool. It's kind of in the middle of a jungle area. Uh, we've been going there pretty consistent. They have a little restaurant. And uh, I got to say, I was theorizing <clears throat> at one point uh, earlier on during the week that you know, the 80s music phenomena in the taxi cabs. I definitely think that it's a, it's a method used to calm the gringo in the taxis, but at the same time, uh, I, I kind of feel that the 80s music is uh, it's just beloved here in general. You know, you're sitting down, you're hanging out, and Starship is cranked at full potential, and you got Whitney Houston, the Human League, and these, uh, these Costa Rican people are head over heels about it, and they're just like singing word for word, like it's, uh, it's the brand new hip and up and coming thing. But uh, I, can't, uh, I cannot express enough how cool, gentle, kind, non-judgmental, uh, and peaceful these people are. Uh, absolutely phenomenal. Everybody greets you with a handshake, everybody smiles, uh, and, and there's like absolutely not like one ounce of, uh, of any like non-judgmental or uh, scowling uh, because we're the crazy gringos hanging out. So I've had a great time. Weather's been absolutely perfect. It's been like 82, 85 and sunny every day. So uh, it's been absolutely just uh, it's been a wonderful first week here. So it's been a couple of days since I've blogged, but a couple things to talk about. I'm just going to kind of go be random here, but I, uh, I'm going to queue up a uh, couple things on uh, the Word, Microsoft Word that I wrote down. So, uh, there's one thing in general that I'm noticing around here though is that the cost of living is, 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 is relatively low. Uh, we're, we're up in Escazú, which is outside of San Jose, about 20 minutes. Uh, it's in the mountain, it's more in the mountains. And it's it, it's a it's a it's a pretty cool pad. I, I wish I could videotape and show everybody, but uh, I don't have the means with uh, the built-in webcam and using it as a cam right now. So I'm going to try to figure that out along the way. But uh, you know, for the most part, it's you know, cost of living is cheap, but like the food and, and and just everything in general, like most of the beers, unless you buy like especially if you buy imported beer here, it's, it's mighty expensive. It's just uh, you know, everything is is about the same as the states. So I wonder to myself. Not like I'm Mr. Moneybags at this point, but I wonder that you know that the people here that you know make it minimal how they, they how they actually survive, uh, because a lot of the groceries and a, a lot of uh, the merchandise and eating out in general is uh, is about the same price. It's it, it's very it's, it's it's very equal to the United States. So I w I'm kind of surprised about that. I mean, there's certain things that are a little bit cheap, like there's some cheaper taxi cab rides and. Like I said, the cost of living is the big one that's uh, that's uh, uh, you know really noticeable as far as <clears throat> you know it, it, it's definitely much cheaper. But uh, a lot going on. Still going to delve into a, a lot of different things. I'm going to be here for probably anywhere from two months to about three months. So uh, we may go to the coast next month. I may have a freelance writing gig. I don't want to jinx that and talk too much about it. But uh, you know, drinking the drinking the bruscados playing the tennis, getting the massive sun exposure, which is always a good thing. 
I just want to wake up in the middle of the night profusely sweating and uh, have my skin all bubble up and like, you know, uh, you know, falling off at the, uh, falling off at the seams or whatever. Uh, I'm good and uh, life is good and uh, I hope you uh, subscribe to my YouTube. Sorry about that uh, crazy blinding light there for a second. It's still, it's like about 4.23 here. So uh, yeah, subscribe if you dig the vibe and uh, donations as well uh, through PayPal. Robinson Derek at hotmail.com if uh, if you want to support the cause and that all you will receive uh, the new ebook and uh, two songs off the new album as well so uh, love to all happy Sunday and talk to you soon